Hello folks, how are we? We are coming to you this weekend from the great city of Elgin. And boy, do we have a slam dunker here. This thing is cray, 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 crazy. Uh, I'm going to try to get through here as quickly as possible. I know I promise that every single time and uh, rarely deliver short videos. I apologize. There's just so much to see here, folks. Fossils, uh, every kind of uh, seashell. Try saying that ten times fast. Rock, stone, got some mother of pearl back there. Check out the size of this crystal, quartz crystal. It is monstrous and uh, very heavy. Bring help. Okay, uh, got some seashells for aquarium decoration. A lot of metaphysical uh, uh, quartz and other stones. I don't know anything about it, I have to be honest. Uh, nice leather sofa, gorgeous shape on that plaid cloth over there. And check out the cute, the cute little child's recliner. That is really, really cool. Um, over here, well, over here we've got more and more and more. And I could stop and provide descriptions for like every single one of these things, uh, even though I don't know as much about it as I should. Uh, nice television set. Uh, back there, some, some uh, little uh, folk artwork back there, etc. Uh, recliner. More. More and more, folks. I, you know, I just, uh, I don't even know what to say about it. Um, this is a great house in a great neighborhood. And as you would expect, it's sold already. Check out that ti tiger stripe stuff. Also got some fluorite there. Um, just crazy, crazy stuff. Probably the cutest little check teacup set I have ever, ever seen. Check out the color, how it pops on there. Both uh, kind of an opalescence thing. And I got to do this. Okay, um, but really, really, really cool stuff. Baseballs, okay, haven't even taken a picture of these. It's a new discovery, folks. Got some Roseville there in the back. Um, got, uh, most of these are original signatures, okay, including what we believe to be a Ron Santo. Uh, we, we know that one for sure is an auto sign. Uh, here again, sorry, I'm going to buzz through this as quickly, as quickly as possible. We're still in the process of setting this thing up. We open Thursday, close on Sunday at 3. So we'll run Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Okay, open at 9.30. All right, if you folks have any questions, please let me know. Funky Orange Sink. Okay, not for sale, just loving it. Um, and, uh... Let's see. Okay, in here. More and more and more. But I've got to get you guys to the basement because uh, it's just cool, cool, cool popping stuff. Uh, love the Pyrex Cinderella over there. Really good. Uh, furniture is definitely for sale and is in impeccable condition. The gentleman who lived here was, uh, oh, 96 years old. Still living. Don't get me wrong. Uh, still living, but uh, has uh, sought other living arrangements. Now for the now for the basement, uh, and also lots of tools. But I doubt seriously I'm going to have a chance to get to the garage. Okay, because there's just so much else here to see. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Every single example of anything beautiful that could come from the earth. Okay, a lot of metaphysical stuff that I know nothing about. Again. A lot of cool burl, live edge stuff here too, folks. I think probably the largest hourglass I've ever personally seen. This is a very cool piece that's got cut in half. Um, and, but, you, you know, the stuff goes on and on and on for days down here. I'll just, here, just let me show you how big this basement is. It's, it's a full basement, full size of the house with, uh, I don't know, probably eight and a half foot ceilings. Okay? Uh, but here again, just more and more and more stuff. Uh, I've got a very cool uh, wine press that I'm going to get to here in a minute. Uh, I should say fruit press, um, <laughs> regardless of what you do with the fruit juice. Uh, the lady was a home economics teacher, and so there's a lot of canning supplies here. There's also a lot of wool that's, that's already combed and ready to go. Okay, uh, seashells by the seashore, holy smokes, you just can't even imagine. Um, crazy, crazy, crazy. More examples over here, including an unlimited supply, it seems like, of geodes, both cut and not cut. Cool, cool display case. Come and pick it up cheap. Okay, somebody can put this thing to use in one of their stores. Tools, like I mentioned, there's more in the garage, but folks, I really doubt I'm going to get there. Okay, 
So, with that having been said, there's the cool press down there. All right, and then somewhere around here, I've got a butter churn. I've also got lapidary equipment, both saws and also buffer polishers. Okay, but here again, I'm trying to make my way through as quickly as possible. Really cool bells, and they sound great. Uh, and then, uh, let me see, more stuff over here. Kind of walking you through fast. I know all of this stuff, folks, these boxes, etc., et are loaded, loaded, loaded with very, very cool specimens from the earth, okay? Some of which I'm sure could be, go could be cut. There's one of these saws, uh, lapidary saw. And then, uh, like I mentioned before, bags and bags and bags of already combed wool ready to be spun, okay? Uh, you don't have to buy it in the raw state and then comb everything out by hand. It's already done for you, and I've got bags and bags of it. All right, a lot of cool antique items here as well. This is how the farmers used to get their chicken eggs out to market. Um, but very, very cool stuff in every single nook and cranny of this house, uh, including some clothes, housewares, etc. There's the butter churn next to a really cool Vagabond vintage cooler. Really cool. Anyway, listen. I'll stop talking. You guys come out and see us this weekend. Uh, you won't be disappointed. It's, it's, it, it's really a spectacle to see. Um, so look forward to seeing everybody. Look at the size of that geode. Okay, the thing weighs like 75 pounds. Um, okay, we got the tapestry over here. All right, and like I said, I'm not even going to get to the garage. Folks, I hope everyone is well. And uh, we'll come out and visit us this weekend. Like I said, you won't be disappointed. It is a fun, fun, fun sale. See you soon. Bye-bye.